if you have never built a website before then you are probably overwhelmed you have no doubt heard about wordpress and you are interested in finding out more but you don't know what to do next so first let's understand what is wordpress at its core wordpress is the simplest most popular way to create your own website or blog in fact wordpress powers over 33% of the websites on the internet yes more than one in four websites that you visit are likely powered by wordpress on a slightly more technical level wordpress is an open source content management system licensed under gpl version 2 which means that anyone can use or modify the wordpress software for free a content management system is basically a tool that makes it easy to manage important aspects of your websites without needing to know anything about programming. The end result is that WordPress makes building a website accessible to anyone, even people who aren't developers. You might be thinking that what kind of websites we can make with it. Really good websites like TechCrunch, Microsoft, GitHub or really crappy ones. On this note, I want to tell you that Microsoft's blog, TechCrunch and GitHub's blog all are powered by WordPress. WordPress is completely customizable and can be used for anything. Most of the people looking to build a website are often enticed with tags free and unlimited. While you can download and install WordPress for free, you have to look beyond what is not told. Of course, there are no hidden costs, but if you value time, that is the ultimate hidden cost. Because most of the hosting providers charge you money for hosting your websites on their servers. If you are a complete beginner and you are thinking what am I talking about, then I promise you, after this whole course, you will learn many things. Like what hosting provider you should choose or how can you secure your website from bad guys. and many more things.